What up, what up, what up, what up? Good morning, everybody. Good morning. It is day 67, June 22nd. Yeah. Shout out to my pops, man. His birthday was yesterday. Happy birthday to you. Oh, man, how you doing? Hope everything is well. Um, yeah, man, we just starting up this morning uh, at the Howard Johnson. Um, about to leave from here in about an hour or two, man. Head back to the trail. Get some miles in. Uh, hope y'all having a blessed day. Whenever y'all watching this, morning, noon, and night, whenever. Um, you know, we're going, I don't know how many miles we're going today. I ain't really worried about pushing big miles. We're going to make it to Maine. Don't worry about that. We'll get there. Um, been trying to stay stay focused, get off these Virginia Blues. I feel pretty good now, though. I've been feeling pretty good. We reached a couple milestones. We hit Dragon's Tooth in the rain, thunderstorm. Boy, I was dropping them poles. Because the closer I get to the top, I kept climbing ridges. Closer I was getting to the top, man, the more the thunder was just dum 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 dum, And lightning started striking. I said, oh, I got, I got two lightning rods in my hand. So I kept dropping my poles, taking a little quick breaks, and it was raining all on my back, but it was cool. Wish I could have got it on camera up there, but, you know, it was one of them things, my battery. Y'all know my battery been going out on me. But I got some new ones uh, yesterday when I got to... Uh, Got here the devil. I had some, I had ordered some off Amazon, so I got two new batteries, so we should be kind of good on the record thing now, so that's cool. So, you know, we hit a few milestones, hit Dragon's Tooth, we hit McAfee's Knob, and today when we leave here, we'll be on uh, a third of the way done, so that's cool, like 730 something miles, it's a third of the way. So I might stop and do the, uh, the Peter Pan right there, I might stop and do the Dan Roof, you know what I'm saying? Oh no, baby, what is you doing? <laughs> I might stop and do that, so we'll see. But uh, yeah, man, everything pretty good. Like I said, we ain't really worried about miles, man. Uh, like when you sit around at, at uh, these shelters or whatever at the camps and you talk to people, man, everybody's so focused on making big miles. Oh, and everybody got their math done. Well, if you do 14 miles a day, then you'll make it to Katahdin by September, whatever, and you can take five zeros. And then you talk to another person, they got a whole nother equation. And, and how you can make it by this certain time, um, this window or whatever. I really ain't pushing for no time window. I get there when I get there. That's it's all a part of the journey, man. You can't just rush stuff like this, man. This is a exploration of yourself, and figuring out who you are, figuring out how you, you know, other people. I mean, you, you figure out a lot out here, and trying to rush and put time limits on stuff like that just don't work too well. So I, I notice a lot of those people that do that uh, end up getting off the trail, you know, like. We've been running to a lot of people lately that was bragging at first, oh, I'm doing 30 miles and I'm doing this. And one guy, he's running by me, I'm doing 35. And I come to here the other day, he's been off the trail for like two weeks because he's been hurt. So you just can't push yourself. You just got to stop and enjoy it, man. Um, so every day for about the past week now, I've been taking at least an hour, hour and a half out of every day and just doing absolutely nothing because, uh, hey, look where I'm at. I mean, well, not right here. Not right here, this spot right here, but look where we at, man. We on AT, we up in these mountains, seeing the most the, the most beautiful scenery. I mean, well, we in the green tunnel now, ain't much to look at, but we've been having pretty good views for the last couple of days. But man, you just in, you supposed to sit and enjoy this. So we stopped the other day for about an hour and a half at uh, Sarver Holler Shelter and uh, sat down there. I got my sleeping pad out. I took a nap and everything, laid back, kicked back. We ain't in no rush. Man. So. For those that plan on doing this, man, just always keep that in mind. It ain't a race, you know. If you can push big miles safely and your body don't be, be affected by it, you know, cool. I can push 20s if I want, you know what I'm saying, all day. Um, and I do probably two or three 20s a week at least, you know. But any other day I'm going to do 15, 20, something like that, you know. But it ain't a race. It ain't a race. So just enjoy it. Enjoy the whole journey, man. The, the journey is the destination as they say whatever so um let me see what else i got uh oh yeah ready to get out this town man and they wouldn't sell me no beer in this town yesterday they told me i looked too young um they looked at my id they had a a meeting over in the corner with my id everybody looked at it like four or five people was looking at it in the store and they come back to me and told me they didn't feel comfortable selling me alcohol because i looked under 21. Now, i don't know what who they was looking at, but it definitely wasn't me. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that's one of them things, man. But that's that town life, man. Like early riser, like he say, stuck in the matrix. It's the matrix down here. So 
ready to get back up in the hills where I feel feel real and, and, and safe. Um, but then, okay, let me say this. I wonder what y'all want to see as far as like, you know, like t the technical aspect of being out here, uh, like showing like how to hang a bear bag properly, how to filter your water properly, how you, you know, how you handle your blisters, whatever the case may be, all that type of stuff. What would y'all like to see? So maybe we can do some uh, little educational inspiration, I mean, informational videos, something like that, um, and show y'all how we really make it happen out here. Um, that way I can put some more people on camera, stuff like that, we can get some more insight. Mm -hmm. So just let me know, man. Leave it in the comments. I'll, I'll be make sure to uh, look at all these comments and try to get back to everyone as quickly as possible. There's a lot of them though, so bear with me. Bear with me. No pun intended on the bears. Da -dum -dum -dum. <laughs> but anyway, man, like I said, man, I hope y'all having a great morning. I hope y'all enjoy rocking with me. Who is that down there? Oh, pardon me. Hope y'all enjoy rocking with me. I, I really do appreciate everybody that watches, everybody that subscribes, man. All the love I've been getting along the trail. Um, it's really appreciated, definitely. And uh, as always, man, I hope y'all having wonderful time in your life you just got to be happy man just be grateful because it could always be worse so you just got to be grateful man and thank thank god for the small ones man you know just give thanks for the small ones like to me or a, a, a flushing toilet and a hot shower i don't get no better than that right now and that's basics when you think about it in america anyways so just be grateful man as always man love and light it is the Black Alachia. Peace.